Hello everybody, my name is Nasty Wolf. In this video we are going to get all of today's seasonal candles. We'll also do our daily quests, find information on today's shard event, and find the uh, treasure cakes. First up though, we're going to grab the seasonal candles. We have one up in the social space of the hidden forest, and the rest are all below. So let's fly down to the end of this cloud tunnel and I'll meet you down there. Our second seasonal candle bundle can be found right in front of the first gate here. Grab this one and then make our way through. I'm gonna fly through though. Oh my goodness, never mind. Goodbye, gate. And then the other remaining two are just past the second gate, so we're just gonna fly over. We should have one immediately past this gate. Right here. And one towards the end of where we would finish the Shiver Spirit, right here. Collecting all four of these should give us one total seasonal candle when we forge. With those collected, let's get started on today's daily quests. Thirty pieces of light can be obtained from candles or by burning darkness. We just have to pick up thirty pieces of individual wax. To meditate at Forest Clearing, all we have to do is go down the cloud tunnel and go a little bit to the left and you should see the meditation shrine here. All we have to do is sit and then a prompt will pop up and we'll write something to that prompt. Alright you guys, hold on to your hats. This is a bit of a challenging one. We have to relive the laid back pioneer today. Who we can find? inside of this tree trunk. This is a carry ball quest and there's a lot of rain and it's pretty difficult but if you take it slow and steady you should be fine. So as you can see above the spirit there there are some like canopies. I think they're mushrooms. I'm just gonna call them canopies and you can wait for your light to recharge under there. If you collect the spirit your light will also fully recharge which is pretty good. So we're just gonna want to be as patient as we can Plop, plop, plop. We'll go under this canopy here. Wait for it to recharge most of the way. And then across to the spirit. I find going up the next hill is the most challenging part to me. Once we tap them, we'll be fully charged. Boop. All right, so the canopy here is a bit weird. I like to stay on the right hand side of these stairs for a little bit. Let myself recharge a bit. And then I usually go on to the left side right away and hide under here until I'm fully charged. If you're scared, you can also go into the gazebo, which is directly towards our left. But usually from a full charge, I can go across to this tree trunk. Oh, Stinky died, no. Across to this tree trunk here and recharge. Ooh. Careful. Almost died there. Now we're going to go to that spirit, and we should be fully charged once we collect them there. Again, it's under a canopy, so you're pretty safe. And then the rest of the way up is pretty easy. There's a ton of canopies, so there's plenty of places to hide on both the left side and the right side. All you have to do is look up. Um, I've done this a couple times, though, so I don't really have to look up as much as I would if I were new, but uh, see, we have them on the left, on the right, on the left. I'm just gonna go to this one, but you can always go to one closer to start. Wait for it to recharge a bit, and then go to the next. 
patience is key in this one. I don't think rushing through would be very beneficial. You want to be as careful as possible. And then from this point, we're just going to walk straight into the fire pit. The fire pit will fully charge us as well. And we are done. Laid back pioneer. Whew. For today's treasure candles in the Golden Wasteland, our first one is right here in the social space just before we fly down. Our next one can be found in the graveyard all the way towards the end, flying into the battlefield area. Our third one will be at the very front of the shipwreck here. And our final one is in the battlefield area at the very top of the barricade wall. Today's shard event takes place in the Valley of Triumph. We can find it at the ice rink just down here. And it is a black shard, so that means it'll be pretty easy today. And it will award us with regular candles upon completion. Um, this is a recording of one of them, but it finished by the time I got there, so it's not a particularly helpful recording. The times for today's shards are on the screen now. This is in PDT or PST time. If you'd like to convert it into your own time zone, I do have a time zone converter linked in the description of this video. So again, yes, a very, very easy shard event. I don't think there's shard crabs or anything, but I could be wrong. And it'll just be somewhere around the rink. Not necessarily in this exact position. Could be on the other side, could be around, but should be somewhere around here and super easy. Just get some wax. Yeah. Okay, good luck with your shard event today. Bye! And that is it for today's Daily Changes in Sky. Thank you guys so much as always for watching. Hope you found this helpful. Hope you enjoyed. And I will, of course, see you in the next video. Bye-bye!